Hey everyone, in this video I'll show you how to connect your VS Code to your Raspberry Pi. Now obviously VS Code's advantages as a code editor is well known. It's a wide range of plugins including Copilot enables developers to work really really efficiently. And if you use a Raspberry Pi before and have connected to it using VNC Viewer or even the terminal, you might realize how difficult it is to work on the Raspberry Pi directly. The Raspbian OS doesn't natively come with a really good code editor, so I think it's worth exploring how to connect VS Code to your Raspberry Pi and pretty much allow you to develop amazing projects. Um, for this to get going, first enable your SSH on your Raspberry Pi. For that, go to the uh, Raspberry Pi software configuration tool, go to interface options and enable SSH. You might want to reboot if your device asks for it. Uh, mine is already enabled, so I didn't ask. Um, hit finish. And now, in order to get your uh, hostname, just add in the command hostname hyphen i, and that gives you your host, uh, your IP address. At this point, ensure that your Raspberry Pi is connected to the Wi-Fi, uh, the same network as your development machine, uh, and keep a note of your IP address. Now, uh, you might want to go to uh, your VS Code and install this plugin called Remote SSH. This primarily allows you to connect your Raspberry Pi over SSH. Go to the uh, bottom left corner and click on this blue button. Open a remote window and then click on connect to host. Add a new SSH host and here you might, um, you would want to give this command SSH uh, Pi at the rate, the IP address that uh, you noted from your Raspberry Pi 192.168. This may not be same for you all. So given the command, uh, select the configuration file and then click on connect. Uh, now here it's asking you for your Raspberry Pi password. Um, you might want to give that. And now it's connected to your Raspberry Pi. Uh, in order to work on, on the Let's say you have your file structures or your project on the desktop. You can pretty much click open folder and then scroll down and click on desktop and then press OK. And it connects to your desktop. And here, uh, as, you, uh, as you might have seen, I had some files on the desktop here that's showing up here. That's pretty cool. And you also have access to the terminal. Let's test uh, a basic command like hello world. So I want to print hello world here, hello world. And this is coming in from your Raspberry Pi. So yeah, uh, this will enable you to work more freely uh, through your development machine and build amazing projects. I hope you found this video useful. Uh, thank you for watching and see you all in the next video.